Akasan's honest reactions. Akasan, so it's uh, Japan Thursdays here, and this isn't technically about Japan today, but um, might as well just do it because I haven't done an Asian video. I haven't done an Asian in a while. <laughs> Anyways, this one comes from Rocket News, and it's a naughty Korean game pushes the boundaries of acceptable content okay they're basically talking about and I'll, I'll leave the link in the description below but uh talking about how uh, korean television is starting to like uh emulate japanese television and get uh, uh, but just in more of a raunchy way and even though there's nothing sexual about this video um uh, it's just done in such a raunchy way that they're saying that they've gone too far here. I'll read it briefly for you guys. Uh, Japan has long been known for its ridiculous game shows, which often feature some form of humorous torture, but... Is Japanese TV even something that should be emulated? South Korea, which has already had its fair share of weird and wonderful shows, apparently thinks so. This clip is from a Korean t TV show which has been doing the rounds on the internet this week, mostly thanks to its eye extremely eye-catching premise. Premise? Premise? I forget. How do you pronounce that one? While the girls in the clip are not technically doing anything sexual, the result of this footage of... Uh, the resulting footage of this very specifically designed challenges is very much. So, I was kind of stalling also because uh, I was waiting for the clip to goddamn load. But anyways, this clip comes from Korea's No More Show, an adult-oriented talk show which, while it may not exactly be the most respectable thing on the box, actually contains zero nudity and mostly features the host chatting with his gorgeous lady guest about a variety of adult topics. So you mean like Ryan Wright, basically. Like, <laughs> I'll bet with a few titillating games and contests thrown in for good measure. Okay, so this clip is like 3 minutes, 14 seconds. Guys, we are gentlemen here, and women, ladies, I know there's 12% of you here. Let us watch this with an open mind and see if uh, if it really is too far if it goes too far all right are you ready here we go god damn them titties one looks like a That's a foreigner with one of Homegirl here, okay. <laughs> I gotta go to this live action. Hey, hello. But the thing about Korea is you just don't know how safe they are. Now I see where Shorty gets it all from. This shit is like every day for her. Right. Ooh, all that spit in the water, that's what I was gonna say, yeah. Oh, okay. Right? Let's see how. <laughs> Thank you, cameraman. Oh, man. Respectable, right? This should be like try not the fat challenge. Oh, she sucks it. Bro. This kind of reminds me of like the when I was young. The Spanish TV I would be watching and shit. Wait, because I didn't know about like porn yet. Yeah, keep the skirt down. <laughs> 
Like you'd be watching Spanish TV to get off and shit. That's good. Just let the skirt go, babe. You gotta you just. Yeah. You were not prepared. I, you, your lack of initiative is why you failed. What did she say? say? <laughs> like deep throw it. Ugh. even know what to say like um yeah i'm gonna basically go back to the the idea like um i think like i'm going back to the idea of like when i was a kid like the shit they had on spanish television was like almost just the same and it's got it's gotten much more provocative nowadays um so i don't think it's so bad i just think it's actually has more to do with the fact that if you're not um if you've been living here for some time, it, I'm talking about in Japan, you're so used to all this shit being so censored and just so innocent and just so like boring sometimes of like, I don't even like, I don't even watch Japanese TV anymore. Um, I have a line, a cable line for it. So I can, I guess, I think that's what it's for. It's like, so you can watch but uh, you know what? No, no, it's 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 invalid now because I think everything went digital television at at this. P no, 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 no. I take that back. Sorry, I take it back. You still, yeah. In America, it's digital television, if I remember correctly. But here, um, you still can plug it in and get like uh, uh the BS cables, a uh, broadcast cable, all that. Basically, in the end, I just stopped watching. Like I watched it five years ago. I was watching Japanese television a lot, but then I just turned. It just became like the same shit like it's just idle this idle that and really cutesy type of stuff so you know i wouldn't like this i wouldn't say this has gone too far but it's it's the kind of show you would watch you it's the kind of show you would see like at 11 o'clock after 11 o'clock or something like that um i don't even know what time like i don't even have any my yo Korean division of the Red Dreaded Nation. Let me know what you guys think. I think a uh, Seoul, Seoul Jun Cho. I got we got two or three guys in Korea here. Uh, let me know if you guys have ever seen this show. If you think it's too far or whatever, but I mean, again, have you seen what Shorty is doing? <laughs> That shit. It's almost exactly the same, except she's got like these themes. Just go check one of her videos real quick. All right, I'm gonna leave you with that, and you let me know. Red Dreaded Nation, stand up, speak up. Let me know below. I'm out. Here's Shorty. You're welcome. Nice. Oh.